When you can't catch your breath, it can be uncomfortable and even a bit scary. Your heart and lungs work together to bring oxygen to your blood and tissues while removing carbon dioxide. When you have too little oxygen or too much carbon dioxide in your blood, your body gives the signal to breathe harder to get more oxygen in or extra carbon dioxide out. Most of the time, people breathe without thinking about it. But when you are working hard to breathe, your brain sounds an alarm that there is a problem and you may feel anxious or worried. Because of this, you might consider adjusting your activities to avoid feeling so air hungry. But that would be skipping an important step. When you can't catch your breath and this feeling interferes with activities you want or need to do, your healthcare provider needs to hear about it. They can help determine what is going on and if treatment is needed. Share how often you are short of breath and what you are doing when you can't catch your breath. Shortness of breath can be a symptom of a variety of conditions. You may not have an underlying condition, but it's important to find out so you can begin any necessary treatment early. Your healthcare provider will likely listen to your heart and lungs, check how much oxygen is in your blood, and order other tests if indicated. Do not accept feeling short of breath without knowing why. Work with your healthcare provider to determine what is causing it and if treatment is available to help. When you can't breathe, nothing else matters. Learn more at lung.org.